a Google Assistant tutorial on Pixel XL. I'm just going to ask it a few fun things, show you how quick it is, and we can discuss how useful or useless we find it. Unlock the phone with your index finger, hold the button. What's your name again? Did I forget to introduce myself? I'm your Google Assistant. Hi. And you can have a secondary question that's already uh, displayed for you below, like, do you like to party? I like riddles and knock-knock jokes. You know, only the most advanced forms of comedy. And these are the fun things you can do with her. You can have a knock-knock joke told to you, have a riddle told to you. What gets bigger and bigger as you take more away from it? A hole. You can also ask her to sing you songs. Please sing me a song. Finally it's here, I've been waiting for this chance. I could be on Broadway if only I could dance. Nice job, Google Assistant. Sing me another tune. Okay. And that's another thing, is sometimes she'll confuse you asking her to sing a song with actually playing music. Not exactly what I asked her to do, but pretty close. Let's get to the more useful items. How far is it to the Washington Monument from here? You're three miles away from Washington Monument by car. How is the traffic today? Not so helpful, but she'll have me download a GPS system, apparently. Can you set a timer for 15 seconds? Sure, 15 seconds. Can you translate, how's it going, in Spanish? ¿Cómo te va? Can you translate, hey, what's going on, in German? Also, the timer will interrupt Google Assistant. Can you translate, hey, what's going on, in German? Hi, was geht ab? Not so bad. Pretty cool stuff. Can you tell me what the best restaurant is in the area? I prefer to stay in, but I can find you restaurants in your area. Can you open Facebook? So as you can see, she can do everything you ask her, basically, but sometimes she will get a little stuck. Hey, what's your problem? That's what I'm trying to figure out. What is going on with you today? Good evening, Eric. It is 7.02 p.m. The web... What's up today? Here's what I found. Sometimes she will, you know, list your notifications, say what's on your calendar, and sometimes she'll just check the web. And it's not all that consistent, and I think she's actually trying to figure you out. So in that way, Google Assistant is always learning, and it's always improving. In fact, since I've started using this, I've seen her answers change from I don't know what to say to actually having an answer like that's what I'm trying to figure out. So her conversational aspects are improving, and it's actually kind of exciting and an ever-evolving thing. So it's definitely a fun, I guess you would say, computer assistant. Um, it certainly doesn't feel like AI, and it's mostly just using all of the data uh, you you uh, acquire with your Google products. So you kind of have to have that big brother trust with it, where you're just giving it the most um, the most access to your daily life that you can offer if you want to use this Google Assistant. So that's Tech Void's take. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.